All right, guys, apparently this is Redskins related, as in the NFL team, the Redskins, and this thing recently sold free. My name is Burf, and this is my turf. I'm straight out of the thrift store. Hey, what's up? It's your boy Burf. It's Monday, which means it's another day for thrifting, another day for toy hunting. And I'm sitting in the parking lot of old thrifty pants right now, thrift giant over in the colony. And I'm about to head in there and see what kind of goodies they got. So hopefully we hopefully we can find something good, something really epic, man. I would love to find some vintage toys in there today. Always on the hunt for vintage, but I'll settle for some really cool action figures. So let's head in there, keep our fingers crossed, and pray that the thrift gods are good to me today. All right, guys, this is exciting. Every time I go out thrifting, it's exciting. If you get excited about hitting up thrift stores, just comment below and let me know that you get jazzed up over it too. You know, it's just that you never really know what you're gonna find on the shelves. And that's that's the biggest thrill of it all. What's even better is when you actually find something epic, man, and you just get that rush of jazz through your body. Oh, it feels so good. <laughs> so hopefully we can find some good stuff in here. Let's see what they got. Oh, look at this. We got a ton. We got a ton of action figures. Oh, look at this right here. Oh, I don't have this guy. Wow. This is like a little honey hole of 12 inch. All right, let me look through these and see what I can pull out of here. Hey, check these guys out. I got this talking stormtrooper. That's awesome. We also have a talking Hulk, and I'm not exactly sure who this guy is, but I'm definitely gonna get that Stormtrooper and this Hulk. And over here in plushy land, we've got this child Grogu from the Mandalorian. They want $5 for him. I'm probably gonna pass on him because the last one I bought, I sold on eBay, but I actually lost money on it because I didn't calculate the shipping very well. So I'm gonna pass on this guy. But uh, let's take a look around and see if we can find anything else. Looks like we've got a vinyl collectible from Fallout right here. That's kind of cool. All right, guys. So I sorted through all of those figures. These are the only ones actually worth something. So combined, these things are worth about 70 to 80 bucks is the resale value on them. I can pick them up for $12. Hulk selling for about 18 bucks. He's selling for about 50 and he's selling for like between 10 and $15. So I'm gonna pick these three guys up and leave the rest there for someone else to snag. All right, well, hey, that was a quick trip. We got some cool scores out of there. Got a little money in the bank. So let's head on over to Goody Wheel next and see what kind of goodies they got. Well, golly, I got my hairs cut. Oh, Yeah, I decided to stop and get my hair cut. Before we hit up Goody Wheel, man, I gotta I got look fly and fresh when I go in here, you know what I mean? So anyway, we're here, we are here, ha <laughs> ha! And uh, we're gonna head in here, we're gonna keep our fingers crossed and pray that the Goodwill gods are good to me today. What you got for me today, Goody Wheel? What you got for me today? <laughs> All right, let's head in here. All right, let's see, what do we got here? What is this, the Hoggett Children's Charity? I've never seen this before. It's interesting. All right, guys, apparently this is Redskins related, as in the NFL team, the Redskins. You like that? You like that? And this thing recently sold for $84. forgot to mention this one is actually autographed by this big mac guy so when i was looking at the other hoggett memorabilia there were other autographed ones and this big mac person had a signature on them so i guess maybe that adds to the value of it but to be able to flip it for potentially 84 dollars yeah i'll take it and we've got some vehicles over here looks like this might be like a joker vehicle we've got some sort of trash truck and the child detection agency all right hey well that was a sweet score man <laughs> super sweet so all right well here's what we're gonna do next we're gonna head home and i've got a mail call i've got one of my subscribers 
sent me something in the mail. Shut up, dog. Come on, this car open. <laughs> so, but my, uh, one of my subscribers sent me a package and said, hey man, I'm gonna send you something and you know, feel free to open it up for on your channel. So anyway, uh, long story short, we're gonna do a box opening. So let's he head home and see what kind of goodies he sent me. All right guys, so we're back at the house and like I said, we're gonna open up a package. We got a little mail call to do this. Mail is coming from a subscriber of mine and I also subscribe to his channel. He is CV Baseball Collector. So I recommend that you go give his channel a subscribe and check it out, especially if you're a baseball card collector. He does weekly, uh, actually like daily pack openings. It's a great channel and uh, he's become a good friend. So go check it out. Uh, dude, I just gotta say, man, thank you so much for sending this. I'm excited to see what's inside of it. I know you said it'd be something that I'd probably like, so I'm excited, man. All right. Me too, let's, let's see. Yeah, let's see. There's a few action figures in here. I can feel that there's quite a bit going on be in gentle, here. Be gentle, be oh, gentle. Yeah, don't wanna break anything. Oh, oh check oh. this out. <laughs> awesome. All right. Oh. We got a lot of wow. a lot of little goodies wow. in here. <laughs> There's actually a note in it's here. It's like a as little well. treasure chest. Yeah, it's like a little treasure trove. Yeah. All right, so let's get uh there's something else in here. All right. So, wow. You know, this is Did you read the note first? Well, just real oh, quick. Okay. This, Sorry. this is vintage. Like this is oh, like Oh. I remember you, those. You, you put the little people yeah, in there. Yeah, you put the little yeah, people in here, huh? right? Yeah. Yeah, as a matter of fact, Hold up just a second. Boom! Through the magic of television. For all you youngins out there that don't know what we're talking about, this is a big version of those little people. So this would be about half the size or a quarter of the size, and then you would just set them right down in here, so a little cart. So that's cool, man. What a throwback. What a throwback. So what else do we got in here? Oh, we've got some vintage 1980s Army ants. Oh, that's oh. awesome. Dude, I don't have I don't have this one. The sniper? I've got a little collection of these going, but I don't have this sniper, so that is super cool. Check out this guy, man. Those are absolutely fantastic, man. Thank you so much. And what else do we got in here? Oh my gosh, this is vintage as well. And I can't remember the name of this line, but I know they're like from the late 70s early 80s yeah. but how cool is that yeah, it's uh she's cool trans lady right yeah. yeah she's translucent yeah so this is, is she really like, cool. oh she's got a card on her chest is that a card uh it's like a it's a it's a it's not like you're thinking like it's a playing card like oh, yeah. like diamonds or something oh, okay. no it's just like a chest a robotic plate. i can't remember the name of this line mm. super cool though this is cool. here we've got another vintage figure Man, all these little vintage, all these little vintage treasures are super cool. And let's see, what do we got here? I don't know who this guy is. I have no clue. It's pretty cool though. Kind of looks like an ant a little bit. So we got him, and then we got this Scottish, this Scottish drummer. He's pounding the drums. So he's got his little kilt on, so that's cool. And what do we got here? Oh, what? What is this? Is this a pancake? <laughs> it's, it's a got hamburger. A, it's, like it's got a, a pickle looks, on it. Oh, bun. is that a pickle? I thought See it was a bun. It's I, got the pickle and the ketchup uh, on the inside. Yeah, I thought it was a kiwi. <laughs> <laughs> it's a bun. You oh. like buns. <laughs> yeah, I like buns too, especially your buns. <laughs> hey, here's another Scottish oh. guy. Another. So that's cool. We got at least two of them to go together. Hey, check this out. Let's put them together down here. Play some music. <laughs> <laughs> Most annoying sound in the world, right? Especially coming from us. Right? And then I'm not sure. Does that go with to. the other card? I don't know. No, I don't think so. No, I don't know what that goes to. Hmm. And then we got this little car right here. These kind of look like McDonald's toys yeah. or something like that. Oh, dude, is this a GoBot? Oh, mm. dude. This is Slicks. 
This is freaking awesome. Oh, dude, I love this. I love it. Let's see if I can transform them here real quick without breaking them. Oh, here we go. Let's move no, this. with keeping him safe. Keeping him secure. Yeah, right. Speak what you want. Oh, check this out. Okay, so let's go ahead and put this down. Go, back, go. Yeah. <laughs> Anyway, I'll figure it out later, but that's what he would look like. Oh, yeah, he's got his sunglasses. Dude, I love GoBots. I love GoBots more than I love Transformers. I've got a great collection of GoBots. So thank you. This is epic, dude. This is really awesome. Thank you so much. And then we got this Indian, which I just picked up an Indian at one of these ones similar to this at Goodwill a little while back. He was in a baggie, so that'll go good with him. And then this looks like it'd be yeah. some sort of Dungeons and Dragons type of guy. I don't know. So we got that. Oh, look who we got here. We got Daffy Duck. Can't go wrong with a Daff. What's up, Daff? And then. What's that tiny little thing? This is a little Star Wars. Oh, yeah. He's a. A trooper? Storm he, trooper? He's like a, like a, yeah, like, like a beach trooper, like a beach scout or something like that. No, he's just halfsies. Yeah, just little halfsies. And then we've got this Lego guy. I don't know. And then we've got a we got a guy, an astronaut, and uh, going to uh, you know the fake moon because <laughs> we never went to the moon. You guys know that, right? We never oh. went to the moon. We never went to the moon. <laughs> so, and then also, what else do we got in here? We've got a couple more items. Oh, look at this little baby Chewbacca. Oh, it's cute. Yeah, he's cute. And then we got... He should go on my shelf. Yeah, we'll put him on your shelf. Which, by the way, we had some people requesting that they wanted to see an update on Nicole's collection. Oh, so we'll have to show that to them. We got yeah. this Knight. So check that out. And then this is G.I. Joe. Uh, this belongs to a dreadnought, and I'm trying to remember his name. He's like a, like a bushwhacker. Uh, is that his name? Actually, bushwhacker. I forget. But anyway, is this thing uh, like a pig. Would yeah, it's pigs? like a wild boar. Yeah, yep. So this is GI Joe, vintage oh. GI Joe from the '80s. Oh, look at that little Mickey D. Oh yeah, He's check with that the hamburger, out. Yeah, right? this is a that, hamburger. Was, this is oh, yeah. this is Mayor McCheese. Oh yeah, Mayor McCheese. Yeah, we'll have to put him on your shelf too. He's pretty cool. Yeah. So we got that, and then we looks like we got some sort of oh, rabbit. That's the bunny from um, uh, Minecraft. Minecraft. Minecraft, right? Bunny. Yeah. And then also we got this little raft. Water boat. Yeah, a little water, little uh, river raft with uh, with an engine nice. on it. All right. So here's what the letter says. So let's see what the letter says. It says, "Hey, Burr." So I thought of you as the perfect person for these interesting and loose toys. <laughs> I hope you enjoy checking them out. Try to get to a thousand, trying to get to a thousand subscribers and only need 109 as of today. Sincerely, sincerely, CV baseball card collector. So, all right. So awesome. guys, as of January 12th, he only needs 109 subscribers. I've got a little over 1700 subscribers, surely. 109 of you could just go over and subscribe to his channel and check it out. So I'd really appreciate that. It would be a true compliment to me. It'd be a way of paying me back for all the amazing content I'm giving you guys. <laughs> if you go over there and just subscribe, I'm just teasing. Show some but, love. Yeah, but just go show him some love. You know, it's a, this YouTube community is awesome. You know, if you're on Facebook, it's nothing but negativity. Instagram has a lot of negativity on there as well, but YouTube, you know, on these toy channels, the love is there. So just, if you would just show a little love to CV Baseball Card Collector and go check out his channel, I'd appreciate it. So hey, if you're enjoying watching this content as much as I'm enjoying making it for you, do me a favor, smash the like button. Let me know in the comments below of all the things that CV Baseball Card Collector sent me, which one was your favorite? I'd have to say it's this GoBot. This thing is truly epic in my opinion. But I mean, all this stuff is cool, but this, this is my absolute favorite. 
Also, give me a follow on Instagram and Tickety Talk at 80s Toys Rock. Rock is spelled R O C! <laughs> In the meantime, we'll catch you on the flip side.